All right, welcome to a new video. Today we have this mechanical, retro mechanical keyboard. It's like Nintendo. Look at that. 8 bit though. I think that's how you say it, pronounce it. I really don't know. 2.4 uh, 2 gigahertz. That's like the Wi Fi thing. Could be USB and Bluetooth. So I think I'll test it. I think I'm going to test it with the, the Steam Deck. Then I'll just leave that for my main PC. Try to build a main PC and a NAS server so I can start uh, backing up all my movies onto a NAS server. So there it is. It's nicely opened. We got these giant buns uh, that do uh, some special stuff. You can program them to do whatever you want. You can buy more of these. They're just, you know, big buns to smash. Uh, nothing on this side, nothing on that side, nothing underneath. So there it is. I'll leave a link in the description. Bam. So that's the Wi Fi, Bluetooth, and USB, 87 keys, PBT keycaps, mechanical switches, hot swappable, and programmable keys. So there it goes. Let's see if I can get this out of there. Alright. Oh, this looks nice. Feels heavy. Okay, so we get some stickers in here, the manual on how to program those keys. You can put uh, different stickers onto those keys. You get the whole full manual. Got the USB type C cable. And then we have these big old buns. I mean, they're big. I don't have a big hand, but they're like big giant NES buns. All right. Get this guy kind of crooked. There it is. Where, where do we open this from? Over here. Bam. I like it. Let me bring a controller. This is not a true NES controller, but it's very similar. If you put it there, you can see the theming, you know. Sounds nice. You got the Nintendo gray. This Nintendo like cream color. You got these buns. I don't know what those are going to do. Alright. So that is what? Uh, FN and the uh, Windows, isn't it? Should be these right here, but you see everything's programmable. We got some. Okay, so you got the off, the Bluetooth, which already turned on, or the Wi-Fi. You can see the Wi-Fi there. You can probably click it. There's certain things there. You got the eight bit o, like the module thing. snaps with the magnet pretty cool and then here is where you connect this puppy there one of these so that means maybe that you can expand it to four modules of these is that true i'm not sure it, it feels heavy it feels nice and sturdy and then you could yeah, that's that's cool now I, I could use this I could use this with the, the PC and then have everything set up here. <clears throat> yeah, I think I'm going to set up the PC with this computer. Well, uh, I mean with this monitor, this keyboard. And I just got to get a mouse and then do it wireless. I'll, I'll get a wireless mouse. Have everything here wireless. Have this. I think that's cool. I like it. I like it, actually. 
All right, I'll leave a link in the description if you want to go look. There's a Famicom. So this is the NES version. There's a Famicom. I think this is a hundred bucks right now. It, it does bring that stuff. And it, as you can see, it was Bluetooth uh, wireless or wired. Because you could do it wired right there, which will be the least resistance. So that will be the, I think the quickest response will be that. And then wireless. And then I think uh, Bluetooth. I'm not sure. Uh, but I'll probably just do wireless. Make it simple. Keep it simple. But yeah, this is pretty cool. Now it matches, you know, my decor here. Oh, my device got too hot, so it turned off the light. All right, that's a uh, that's a sign to uh, wrap it up. Don't forget to subscribe. Check in the description. I have links there. And catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.